This episode of Distraction is sponsored by Landmark College, offering bachelor's and associate programs, short-term and summer programs for students who learn differently. Learn more at lcdistraction.org. Landmark College, the college of choice for students who learn differently. Hello, this is Dr. Ned Hallowell for Distraction with a mini episode. All right, here we go. This is a response to a listener. I am a mother of a 10-year-old daughter. She was diagnosed with ADHD at eight years old. She is on medication. Last school year was very difficult for her. She is a straight A student all year, but her and her teacher did not have a good relationship. The teacher would try to stop behavior before it would happen. We are currently in a new school year, and I'm concerned that we may have the same outcome. How do I talk with teachers without them singling her out? Please help, Kelly. Well, Kelly, um, the first thing you want to do as far as starting off the school year with a teacher is make friends with the teacher. I know that's hard to do because the first thing you want to do is go in and tell the teacher, don't make the mistake last year's teacher made. And uh, you, you, th- those words are popping out of your mouth instantly, but don't do that. The first thing you want to do is say, hi, teacher. Uh, my name is Kelly, and I would like to introduce myself and get to know you. What's your name, teacher? And, uh, and you know, begin a personal relationship. Um, everything will go so much better if you make friends with that teacher. Um, you know, teachers are treated by parents so often impersonally as if they were, you know, servants, as if they were just uh, there at their beck and call. And, and if you can simply treat them with the kind of respect as professionals, as if, you know, you know that they have a hard job and you're there to help them, not just ask for help from them, just say, how can I help you? And then say, my daughter had certain problems last year that I would hope not get repeated, and these are the suggestions I'd have. Would you mind if I shared them with you? Uh, That sort of thing, you know. Do it in a humble way, not sort of saying, this is what I want you to do, but there were some mistakes last year that I don't want to see made this year, and I have some ideas on how they could be avoided. Would you mind if I shared those ideas with you? Rare is the teacher who will say, no, I don't want to hear your ideas. But above all, begin the process by making friends with the teacher. Make an alliance. It's it's so it's so often forgotten, and yet it's obvious If you want anything from anybody, the best way to do it is to make friends first. If somebody wants something from me, I'm much more likely to do it if they make friends with me first. And maybe that's what being polite is all about. Whatever you want to call it, if if you're nice to someone first, the chances are they'll be nice to you back. And, And that's what civilization is about. And that's why and how we do things for one another willingly, happily, without being coerced or or forced into it. So, Kelly, my advice to you is make friends with the teacher, ask her how you can help her, which will greatly increase the chances that she will want to help you and your daughter. I hope that helps you. This is Dr. Ned Hallowell with a mini episode of Distraction. Distraction is a project of Sounds Great Media. The podcast is recorded and edited by the marvelously talented Pat Keogh. And our producer is the extraordinarily talented Sarah Gurton.